You gotta get a little closer to Mike because you do sound far away. You got Dustin, you, you need to learn you to make sacrifices. You just like extend it a little. Well, I, I, he, he can, it I can extend because it, but you he, need he, to. I'm not right there. If you want, you can extend it closer to you a little yeah, bit. Dog, yeah, dog. Hit just the about second to say, knob. Just hit the extension knob. Second knob. Why am I the one doing all this work? Because it's your fucking mic. <laughs> Who is he? <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> He is. <laughs> Yo. That went Does from this kid zero not exist right now? To a thou wow. Well, that was the first knob, but okay. That's fine. No, it all works the same, guys. Guys, Damn. guys, <laughs> guys, let's fix your wire. Yo, do you while you're at it. This shit looks, looks sloppy. You. <laughs> Yo, it it looks go, sloppy I go loud, shit. bro. I was gonna say, you can fix that. I got like OCD with that shit right now. What am Please. I fixing now? The, the, pop, the, the pop filter. The pop filter. The pop filter. Yeah, I was on the wire. Me and Maddie is talking me All y'all motherfuckers. <laughs>What's up, guys? I am... Oh, what are you doing? I'm fixing the filter, motherfucker. Do your thing. I'm Matt. <laughs> I'm Matt. This is my crazy podcast. Episode uh, 54, 55. Which one is it? 50? What What episode are we on? Told you. Uh, who are you? Sponsor oh. me, monster. Who are you? All right, who are you? Fuck consistency. I'm pissed. <laughs> Claiborne to MC. <laughs> and I'm Matt from Redundancy oh, Sake. And this is Podcast 54. And this episode is brought to you by... Uh, my hey, you skipped me. If you, you skipped me. No, you didn't say you your name like yourself. usual. No, you skipped me. I said no, All so right, you do you. I'm going to say my fuck name. Yeah, yeah, listen, fuck the ranks. Listen, oh, fuck, the smurf smurf over here. Here. <laughs> fuck the smurf over here. Yo, Keep it going, all right? I need a sponsor, shit, buddy. <laughs> I literally looked at him, and then he we looked down at his phone. I was like, all right, so wait, who are yeah, you? Because I thought we were still asking Jim. Cause he I'm Dusty B. He did say it. You just didn't listen to it. Oh, my God. I mean, we're what? All right, let's 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 just keep keep going. Yeah. Right, first thing. Uh, I, this is going to determine how oh my God. the podcast goes. Huh. Oh. <laughs> going to shit. We're going down. We're going down. Man down. Man down. Oh all right, so let's, uh, first topic. Let's get some uh, some maintenance out of the way. Uh, so... Mine? Um, get comfy in this bumbo. Uh, well, <laughs> so as people, some well actually as no one knows yet, Is Dustin got a job. Yeah. Yeah. So we had to move the podcast schedule around. We used to shoot on Wednesdays and try to like release at the end of the week. And I used to have a job which made it hard. So sometimes at the beginning. Now I'm now unemployed. Now Matt is jobless. Uh, well, no, I'm self-employed. That's what I like to say. <laughs> I'm self-employed. <laughs> so we shoot on Fridays or, or Saturdays now, and we're gonna release on Mondays. Pretty much it. And then it, right now, if you go to mycrazymerch.com and type in the discount code Valentine. Just like where I pointed Dusty B. Yeah, go to, type in the, the discount Valentine. Uh, you get 14% off until I think next Friday, which is, you know, I'll put the date below. It's there. Word. Get yeah. your merch. Yeah, I get need to merch. get my merch. Get that shit. I'm going to get it, Maddie. I promise. I know. It's fine. Yo, Maddie, when can I get that Thompson hat? Uh, don't, 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 don't we have stop. Yeah, <laughs> I want to. Hey, wanna listen, can people comment hat. comment your requests if you want to see any sort of merch. Yeah, yeah comment, 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 merch, hat, comment what merch what you want. Uh, so post down below if you want to see Matt's dick. <laughs> no one wants to see that. <laughs> That's a little too much. Yeah, I actually nah, thought about uh, selling like my V literally card, a little too much. Like a picture of my <laughs> face, and it's called, just the V card. Thought about selling that. No, um, no. <laughs> racist. What? Against against virgins. All right. Um, All right. Uh, anyways, uh, so Valentine's Day just happened. Yeah, man. Yeah, there was on. this person I ran into, and I'm telling you, this guy was so lonely. Yeah? You know right. what his name was? Who? Oh. Nah. Jesus Christ. Shout yeah, out to time. the dogs. Shout out to the dogs. Shout out to Hennessy. It's Hennessey. time we all start taking God into account in our lives. Oh, boys. my God. Stop. Hey, I gotta Stop. 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 What did you guys do for Valentine's Day? Did, did, did anyone do anything for Valentine's Day? Uh, I'd rather not talk yeah. about my Valentine's Day, so you guys go ahead and... Wow, okay. Oh, wow. I worked all day, and then after that, I went out with my boys, and we got drunk. <laughs> Dude, I worked all day, too. Um, oh, yeah, my girl got me a sweet shirt. Oh, shout well, out to the shirt? I mean, <laughs> yeah, I ended up hanging out with my girl, but in all honesty, it wasn't really, you know... What did you buy? 
just you know the usual you know i got her favorite flowers you know she's not a roses type girl got her sunflowers you know what i'm saying and just gave us some candy you know a little calm you know we just hung out and all honesty like that's all she really asked for is my time so it didn't really feel like anything else other than me just you know making it a little extra some candy for some mandy yeah, i got you you know what i'm saying like yo mm-hmm. but it was cool i still you know got lit on my dolly you know she hey. did, so and did the damn thing you yeah, know i uh shout out backside Facts. <laughs> big, up, big up my bibs. Big. You know, so this was the second <laughs> Valentine's Day I've actually kind of been talking to someone. So that was Which I want to give a round of applause to that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Stop. Word. Why not? Word. I don't know, but it just seems like the right thing to do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Matt's been Matt's been through some trials and tribulations here, people. Like seriously, like All right, people not, at home stop. Give, give, give them a give them a slow clap or golf clap, something. You Yo, know? you gotta stop with the clapping. Listen, How I'm about clap comment you, below? Son. I'm clapping I'm real fast. Fight, you're a lot of hostility Boop. here today. Boop. I don't know what's in the air. Every time I drink Hennessy, man, I always get It is the Smash Bros. No, so so here's what happened. You, you don't need smash. a pause on Smash Bros, bro. I'm gonna smash you, bro. The pause. Pause. <laughs> yeah. P- 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 pause, yo. Pause that I don't even like third <laughs> pause, really. But oh, yeah. right. come on, yeah. come on. And what's so crazy is we all took that pause. I even had to look at the camera real quick, like, yo, what? <laughs> yeah. Yo, anyway. first of all. <laughs> Y'all are extra. Anyway, go ahead. Oh, man. we're extra. Okay. <laughs> you didn't yeah. ask what. All right. Yeah. Anyway, so we none of us really did anything for Valentine's Day. Well, okay, let me tell you. I mean, I didn't really do anything on Valentine's Day. We did it the you. day before. We're okay. definitely doing a Let's Play Smash Bros. This is happening. I got you. You ready? What? What are you doing? On Valentine's Day. What did you do? Here's what I got. He just stole the mic. From I did all the fucking work, and his ass was going to just straight take my mic. That's crazy. Here's what I got into on Valentine's Day. I'm going to kill so it, kid. I'm working, right? I'm over here. Let me know if Josh disappears. Yeah. <laughs> and that was it. We don't want this on record. <laughs> yeah, okay. I have no part in this. No, neither do I. No. Nope. Shit ass, don't disappear. I just don't think <laughs> I don't want to go to jail. So. <laughs> I think it's pretty weird that uh, Valentine's Day is on the 14th of February. Yeah, where are you going with this? It's weird. However, though, we are recording the, the day after Valentine's Day, which everybody now should know. It is National Singles Day and a couple other things you that don't really you matter. You guys fucking... I feel what, like people put what, way too much pressure on what the fucking day, great, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're supposed to be that serious. No. What some, great some friends we have in, my, in our group chat, as soon as J- Jim says that, you immediately say, oh, so it's National Maddie Day? Yes, exactly. Shout out to Dusty. Yo, I was out. just cracking jokes, B. I said yeah, just the group chat. The group chat is really vicious sometimes. Oh, yo, yo honestly, yo, out there, if you're watching, comment your most vicious snap uh, group chat conversation. Oh, yo, our group chat could get wild. If that, well, if saying, our group like, chat ever goes live, like if someone, oh, it's oh, bad. Yeah, oh, yeah, it's not nothing but love. Like nobody really means that shit. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, no, I, no, yeah, but de- but if our, like, group- I've literally told Nikki, like that's my girl, by the way, people, like. Maddie's dick is pretty much my dick. Like, if I see another woman, I'm going to lead it to Maddie pretty whoa, much at this point. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, yo, I, I get your analogy. It's, it's not like that. I get your but analogy. It's a wingman thing. I get, yeah. I get yelled at for a video game reference, and, and we're going to slow. Nah, nah, because I get where he's coming from, because it's funny, because I even, you know, <laughs> you seen I reference version? that in my right, track. I'm going to get you some pussy. I reference... Your dick is my dick. <laughs> yeah, you guys facts. Can go like, ahead. On, some bro, on some bro shit. Like, I, I get I got, it, but, but, but he made it sound like you guys are holding each other's dicks, like walking into like the club. I mean, yeah, if you paused after he said your dick you know. is my dick it would have sounded bad but right, that's Jeremy, not what he meant I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that's it like not this. what he meant I, I, I I've get been it. through the military I've seen more dick than any man should ever see I'm so comfortable <laughs> with my sexuality that I don't give a fuck I don't need the pause to say anything. My personal opinion, I walk around butt naked in front of y'all right now and not give a damn. Why? Because we're born butt naked. We come in this world butt naked. Clothes, this don't mean shit. It's all just peacocking. <laughs> One billion like likes not take a dump on camera. So you go ahead and peacock. <laughs> Agreed. But I'm going to chill here in my walk, sweats and my low class clothes. And I'm going to enjoy my life. <laughs> one thousand likes and Jim will take a shit on camera. No, one billion. Him. One thousand likes and Jim will take a shit on camera. One hundred percent. I don't want to see yeah, that. It'll get flagged on YouTube for sure. But you know what? Our viewers, you deserve it. But we will uh, put it on the website, though. Right, Matt? Yes. Yeah. We'll put it on the website like ten times. <laughs> nice. So that pretty much the website's just. And then boring. you got to make an eighteen-year-old fucking entry on the <clears> website. Well, then. I burned the shit out of Jimmy earlier. I told him he was a Trump supporter. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah, yo, that was literally the like, literally. <laughs> so, right, so me, me and this man, me and this man will go back and forth sometimes, say some harsh fucking shit. Pause. Yo, yo but not. I was legit infuriated, like to the point where I'm like, yo, seriously, like that. I was violated. I felt like you like raped my fucking like mind, Damn. my mind, oh, my, 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 my state real, of my state of being, hostile today. my state of being for calling me a Trump supporter. Like that's like. That's like calling a Jew a Nazi. <laughs> but it's funny you, you have a deep seated hatred for this man. That goes yes, deep. it goes so deep. Like wow. he, yo, like he's elbow he's, deep apparently. Yeah, no, no, wow. shoulder deep, shoulder deep, son. Cool. Shoulder deep, maybe even like neck. Damn, is it hard to fist someone? I don't, I don't know. I've never done I've it. Never done <laughs> it. Never, I've never done it. I put I four I... fingers in for sure. Like I've got knuckles. <laughs> I've gotten to <laughs> knuckles one time. You got a grip. Nah, kind of like, ish, like, ish. Like, I got like, I got like, said, I got, I got in, paw. and I got like, yeah, where I got like, kind of like a half claw thing going. I got like a lobster claw thing going on there. <laughs> Nigga, I am monkey the so, pussy. Didn't need the seafood <laughs> reference like this. Smell like there's no smell, but like shape was. I had like a little lobster claw on. thing going on there. She loved it though. Come on, God, are you kidding me, bro? I just, just I pulled my fucking, I lifted my hand up, yo. That shit squirted out like you put your thumb in front of the hose. Like, I swear to God, you know what? Maybe think about that today. And I did that shit in high school, dog. What? Oh, I've been damn. versed. Yo, I've been versed. But yo, it's funny you mentioned Trump at the ass guy. Did y'all see my video I, I, when I was making uh, making fun of, of Trump and shit? Oh yes, 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 yes. <laughs> well, no. The reason I asked about this thing is because I actually went to my old uh, job today, what? and the, my, I was talking to like the people who replaced me, and uh, they were they were just talking about fisting. I mean, mind then, you, I, then, then my second question crazy. was, did they show you guys the same HR video they showed me? And they're like, no, they didn't show us the HR video. I'm like, what? So my last, yeah, why am I because, the only one that had to watch the HR video? No, I'm pretty sure I had to watch the HR video <laughs> why too. Why are we the only ones yo, that had to watch the HR videos? I had to watch videos. HR video too when I, because like, y'all. I didn't watch the, the show's HR gonna video. Me fired you never worked job. there, Josh. <laughs> you never <laughs> worked there. <laughs> you were an intern. Yeah, but no, they, for boss. Just, but they brought it up. They're like, yeah, no, how does fist, you just like. You just like punch. Like, I'm you, like, you, you, know, you just gotta literally. You start off a finger at a time. You go like one, and then two, and then three, do this. and then but three. But I feel like that's not possible four, for every female. And then you though, turn bro. it. Oh no! Hell no! Hell no! Yeah. You gotta work at that. Like yo, know, and not for nothing, yo. Know, if you can go anything more than like. If you go three yeah, and then you turn and you turn that shit sideways, if you, you can go fit. like this smoothly, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah where then then not for nothing, bro. You should bail. Like that, bro. You I should bail. I'm not gonna slush even, shame a woman. That that'd be too much work for me pussy. to even hold my fingers like this. Not for nothing. Yeah, yeah, but the I don't thing, alright, but well, I don't know it, what's it going on over here. I'm just, I'm just. They're talking about going right knuckle here. deep, man. <laughs> Yo, like, like, not, like, 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 I, I not for nothing. Like, not for nothing. Not for Like, I'm a nice guy, so for me to leave in the heat of the moment takes a lot. Like, even in that, I probably wouldn't leave. In all honesty, too. But like, you know, if if I pull my hand out all of a sudden, be like, I see like blood and shit and everything like that. There's there's problems. What? Yo! <laughs> this episode yo. of Beef and Porn brought to you by Jimmy. Done. I don't know what's going on, bro. What? 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 I said really? Beef and Porn. We went there today. Congratulations. Can I say, can I say that Early. I tuned you out? I, I'll Early. say that I tuned you out. What do you mean, you fisting girls? And and once you see the blood on it, you pull it out. Like, bro, you need to stop way before you did there. That's crazy. But yo, but, wow. but, 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 yo, the thing is, yo, the thing is, yo, what things happen in the dark, bro? Like, you know, you yeah, never know. No, oh no, I've never accidentally slipped my fist in somebody. I've no, never no, 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 no. That's an accident. Oh, you work for that <laughs> shit, and if you can accidentally like slow it that shit fist deep, like, bro, then yeah. How do I get? <laughs> nah, bro. I could never. If that ever got, nah, I was going home. I'd be washing my hair with Ajax. Yo, they call me Slipper Fist. <laughs> nah, nah. Nah. <laughs> they got the hard grainy scrubs in there. Oh my god! Scraping your skin yeah, right. off. Yo, the thing, yo, the thing is, I'll imagine like you get in there, right? And you get up like say like I don't know the elbow or some shit and you can like spread your hand right, like listen, oh, listen, that's like stop <laughs> stop you be stuck in that motherfucker. My man spreads his hand he's like oh blood oh no. damn what up? no no you spread your hand you get, like, would you happening? get like stuck why is there blood oh I'm maybe you just gonna open your your fist inside of your cervix you fucking psychopath yo Christian Bale please get away from me. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I, I, broke I broke Maddie. I broke Maddie. You're nipping elbow with a girl. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Yo. 
What? Who looks like Shaq? What? Like, <laughs> hey, yo, Maddie, no, I'm not talking about turning like girl to a sock puppet. I'm First not all, talking about hold that. Hold on, hold on, hold up. So, we all know that after this episode, Maddie's going to go home and he's going to look this shit up, right? I just want to state that. Everybody knows he's going to do that, right? No, I, I got a date after this. Crap, poor science. He said I got a date. Oh, bro. my God. Oh, my God. He's going to ask the girl thing. about it. He's going to be like, you ever had a hand open up in your service? <laughs> Play. She's like, yeah, my. Uh, <laughs> he really died. Oh, it was basically shit. <laughs> yo, yo, I really yeah, wish you had to ask her about your faces. Okay. Have you ever had anyone play you like Kermit the Frog? <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck! What the fuck? I, oh, when yeah, I walked yeah. into today's show, I didn't expect this. <laughs> no, Jim, did Jim puts his hand in the girl. She's like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. She be kicking All around. Right, so she, be, she be kicking around like Godzilla knocking down buildings. Now that we have a surprise topic of knuckle fucking. She's like Fuzzy um, Bear. What's the next topic, Maddie? Word. Jesus. Alright, I'm back to life. Sorry. I'm it on the Hennessy. <laughs> it gotta be the Hennessy. <laughs> I didn't drink anything. Blood really pulled that out of nowhere. Oh my no, god. No, no. Let's talk about Bezos getting fisted. Wow! By the fucking inquirer, they're fucking le- they're they're allegedly sending him like emails talking about how they want to fucking uh, what's it called? Uh, they're like leaking it. They're like blackmailing him to leak his fucking dick pics and shit like that about him cheating. Oh, and he's trying to like take it, it, to like destroy the company cool essentially. Sam. Why? And as the world's cool richest Why would man, do this? Uh, yeah. Uh, I, I, do I think you could probably do it. What did Bezos do? Just kidding. I don't know if I'm a fan of Henny. Slave labor? There's gonna be a face on this one. Henny's great. <laughs> Henny's a good time. Henny thing goes. Yeah, I fuck with Hennessy. What about Henny and Monster Energy Drink? The ultimate combination that'll fuel your night into an awesome inspiration. You guys like that a lot? A little bit of rhyme scheme right there? We're gonna sell? What are you saying? Monacy? <laughs> Monacy. Monacy. Monacy? Monacy. I need, a, I need I to try this. Monster, fuck yeah. that, but I'm trying this. Yeah, I'll have to chase here it. we Sorry, go. Sorry, Bezos, you need to take a break. We need to figure out this Monacy thing real quick. Well, I don't really care yeah, about b- Jeff Bezos. Bezos. Monster, please sponsor us. Into the Henny bottle. I <laughs> 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 just put it right in the Henny bottle. I'll be real with we're you. We're gonna get sued because we're associating Monster with alcohol. About, who cares about Jeff? <laughs> Damn, that shit look like a forty. I <laughs> I just like the gangster oh shit of him trying to take down the car. You're right. That's disgusting, dude. Jesus. That is a Monacy. Oh, oh, Monacy. 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 Do it. Oh. Oh, God. What's wrong with How you? How is it? Fire. <laughs> <laughs> 10 out of 10, we'll do this again. Mm. I mean, just Monacy? make sure you hydrate with water, man. Yeah, give, okay. me, a, give me a sip. Yeah. Oh. Uh, sorry. Try, I try a little you. taste. I'm going to try a sip. I'm Monacy. All right. Oh God! Nah, I'm not that typical white boy. I don't, I don't do it just anything. Yeah, no, nah, I'm good. I'm all for the monacy, motherfucker. <laughs> you opened the one. It's all you ain't with it, it, honestly. Oh, that's disgusting, dude. That is disgusting. <laughs> all about the monacy. That is so it. sweet and for, warm. It. it tastes like God. it tastes. For I real? think. Yeah, no, I fuck that with it. That tastes like drinking right, so syrup. You hold up for Matt to fuck with it. That takes a lot because no. Matt doesn't drink. No, no. that's a fact. That no. tastes like that's a lot though. That's why he likes it because he doesn't drink and he drinks soda. It's like, it's like, it's like, right like, yeah, it tastes like a lollipop. Like Let me ask you a question. Fuck. You guys like it soda? It tastes like a lollipop. It tastes in great. A, in a I am that white boy, I, I guess. I this tastes soda like a, a soda if you added extra syrup it actually smells to good. the soda. It smells good, too. It smells sweet. Dead ass. Mad sweet. Oh, yeah, no, yeah I drink I mean, that. It tastes, oh, God. What's wrong with you? It tastes like a lollipop. About the monacy, baby. Shit. Turn up. Not bad, right? You guys are I could slam that. Yeah, really? exactly. I could slam that. Dude, That's, yeah. Clay, have a taste. You're disgusting. If I'll beings. taste it. You're disgusting. You only need a swig. You're all... Oh, shit. You're all... Lo siento, awful. Awful. No, you're good. You're all terrible people. No, we, we just like monster. And just because your taste buds and Damn, palate are different from ours good. doesn't make us Yo, terrible people. I fucks I mean, with it. obviously exaggerating. I'm just... I'm yeah, away. You know. Fuck you. Oh, shit. Right? Monacy. 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 New single drop in 30 days. Yo. Yo. Mom paying Monacy? I mean, you know That'd be a video. Bro. Couple That's crazy. Clay. 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 You gonna make this happen, Clay? We're all gonna hit the studio. Mom paying Monacy? We might have to do that. You gotta be. Honestly, shit. I might have to throw a verse on it. 
Yeah, no, let's get the well, My Crazy Podcast <laughs> presents yeah, Mon- really good. Modesty and Mon Pain. But That's you gotta be actually, careful though, because uh, Monster Strong is shit. It ain't Red Bull. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what makes it the best. So you gotta be careful. Monster, that's what I'm shit. saying. Make sure you're drinking water, bro. Yeah. Because you will pass the fuck out and dehydrate. Facts. Mm. And you definitely don't want more than, like, I would, I would say don't even have more than one drink. Do you like your Hennessy well, laced with liquid yeah. crack? I mean, one's all I need. I'd probably fuck up that one. <laughs> I don't drink we that often. We should just start bottling it ourselves. I'm down for this. Mm. I'm pretty and sure we'll, we'll just re <laughs> Honestly, with one bro, of those soda if I could figure out how to, how to like rebottle Mon Pain, I would love to rebottle and rebrand that. Stream. Get a Yo, soda yeah, stream. Yeah, you can do that. Get Yo, I know somebody who got a Soda Stream. Just recarbonate. I wouldn't be surprised if you find Monster Soda Stream too. Oh, you can. You can get Monster in a gun. Exactly. What? We wait, just put what? any of Like a the bar, strap. like at the bar or whatever, like in <laughs> oh, a gun, oh, like in oh, a concentrate. Oh, I was like, wait, what? Yeah, no, yeah. I was like, they have like, what, super soakers? <laughs> <laughs> no, but like the thing no, they have well, the Monster Girls, the I think, had some, some sort like of shit. Yeah, like super soakers. Bar. So are we done talking about Bezos? That always seemed constructive about him. Yeah, I guess you guys. Yeah, are Bezos. Like, yo, Bezos. Sorry, bro, but you're this. You, you're, you're, you know, yeah. I just think it's kind of gangster. He's gonna take down the Inquirer. No, he's not. It's kind yeah. of gangster. Bro, he can no, he buy might. the Inquirer. That's how he might take him down. He might buy him and just be like, done. Just yeah, like, and just fire and just, like, everybody. Like, yeah, but why? Like, they're not selling. I mean, they're selling. But like, he can literally buy the company and close it. Yeah, but like, but they're not selling though. Because he's got so he how much? Go how much is Jeff Bezos worth? Like, like 137 billion dollars or some what shit. Up? like Here's that. Here's the thing: it, the, the dude who actually owns it is like in cahoots with Trump and has been helping Trump and like. So that's another thing. So they're, they're is Bezos a Trump supporter? No, Bezos. But that's another reason why a lot of people are behind Bezos right now because this might really hurt Trump. Woo! <laughs> you just got on Jimmy's good side. Because this, this is like, because oh, obviously almost all these media companies are owned by well, like a different I say, Amazon got kicked out of New York. Trump. Oh yeah, Amazon did get kicked out of New York. Yeah, Bajik Trump. might be coming for Trump again. Who know? Which kind, which kind of sucks. That. Yeah, not. Why does that suck? No. Fuck Yo, that. listen. Twenty thousand jobs. Why would you want an Amazon headquarter? Twenty thousand jobs that people are going to be way underpaid and no, die in New York City. No, headquarters. At headquarters. It. Headquarters is like like <laughs> is. executive office yeah. type shit. Yo. Still. I don't care. No, no. They got bad business practices. And, ser- and servers. No, that, but that, that's also the, it's the, gonna be in the center of New York City. Nah. No, no, it's gonna be at the fulfillment. No, I heard. No, no, I heard. Did you? I saw this that. shit today. That supposedly Amazon is. Uh, Amazon will bend the plans to build the H. Uh, the HQ two. Yeah. God damn it, Jim. Headquarters. That's what you said. Yeah. You know. It, so what's? Jim, that it, was. That's what we're saying. God damn it, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> that is literally why we brought this up. <laughs> You no, know, but no, we're talking about Jeff Bezos and his dick pics and shit. Well, yeah, uh, but no, but he just met, he just mentioned God it though. It. He just he just he literally just said it right before he says it. I was like, literally, I was like, I go, oh, I mean, he's trying to get back on our good side because he got kicked out in New York. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even hear that shit. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Right. Well, there you go, radio <laughs> listeners. <laughs> there you go, podcast listeners. Hey, but. I, I mean, Ow. I would have liked an answer. So no, 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 no. If you hit that, that water that, bottle, that's I'm going to tattoo that's your open. neck. That's a little open. Don't be swinging that around. No, it's fully open now. Yeah. I will tattoo your entire neck. I'm going to pour it on you. <laughs> yeah, but just don't, don't <laughs> feed yourself. <laughs> just that's don't fucked be, up. Don't, just <laughs> don't be throwing around with all this electronic around. <laughs> that's some fucked up shit. <laughs> You're going to hold a man down against the room? Are you ready, though, Matt? All right, ready? so do we want to talk about the state of emergency, though, that Trump wants to do? For the yeah, world. I want to know about the shit. Yo, ready? I zoom research. in on this. In about five seconds, uh, Josh can get punched in the head. So it's gonna be a good close up. Uh, yo, if you, yo, it's you better be hit him. It's if you a miss, <laughs> it's <gonna be> a <laughs> while. Uh, uh, I won't miss. He <laughs> won't miss. Uh, yo, Dusty's ready to uppercut. Uh, <laughs> oh no! Uh, oh shit! Uh, oh no! Double sided. <laughs> Boom! I got that whole mischief thing going on too. So it's alright. <laughs> What? Yeah, you know, no science. <laughs> I didn't hear what you said. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker trying to be like Jeff Goldblum over here in Jurassic uh, Park and fucking Josh really vibrate like, water and shit. Josh chicken on this. Uh, uh, as long as it doesn't get anything electric, that's I'm fine. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Is record there? Uh, no, it's recorded. Your record. record. Uh, uh, whatever. <laughs> fucking get it. All right. So, uh, oh, yeah, just, so wait. What's, yeah, what's guys, next on the list here, Matthew? Yeah, the state of the emergency. Let me fuck up. Yo, listen. If this fucking cocksucker does this shit, dude. I don't understand how even his own supporters are still supporting him after this whole. Because they're blind. Yeah, you need to chill, bro. You need to chill. <laughs> they're blind to the truth. Period. No exclamation point. Hashtag woke. Hashtag woke, woke, woke. 
Uh, I said that to uh, the girl I was talking to the other day. I was like, I it made a woke joke. She's like, wait, what? And I was just like, oh, you don't know what woke is? Gotcha. Cool. It's different. That sounds she's, about white. She's no, she's a couple years older than sometimes me. So you gotta, you know, sometimes you gotta some say memes. memes. Some of the memes don't don't uh, don't register the same. Yeah. Yeah. You know how it is. Anyways, no one really cares about the state, the state of emergency because we've already. No, because like, put this way, when it comes, like, put this. I'm kind of holding myself back right now because I'm waiting to see what happens. It's, with that's it. uh, that's um, that's like the first step in to becoming a dictatorship. <laughs> Just wait and see what happens. You forgot your ass whooped as a kid, did you? What? What, <laughs> what happened? Yo, don't make me pour this water on you. But I feel like at some point, everybody's got to turn on him. At some point, everybody's leaving the I White mean, House. I mean, that's the first step toward becoming Hitler, too. You know, like when you're like, I'm declaring the state of emergency because I didn't get my way. Yeah, it's pretty wild. He's crazy. He's a loony. Well, I'm going to do it. We have really nothing else to say about it. It just sucks. We know the court's going to fight him on it. Anyways... Fucking, uh, the Cookie Monster wants to do Fire Festival 2.0 again. The Cookie Monster? Oh, sorry, Jow Roll, same thing. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> He's the Cookie Monster of rap. You know that? Someone didn't listen to 50 Cent's disses back in the day. You know? Did not. Word. Yeah. I was a fan. Sorry, man. I'm home. still a fan. Yeah, I was about to say. Can you, can you fill me in on the reference? You know I'm a fan. It's still G Unit. Oh, <coughs> fill me in for the reference, though. I can't believe G uh, Fitty uh, burned all his Gucci shit. What does that mean? What yeah. does it mean to be the Cookie Monster of rap? Yeah, bro. He just sounds like the Cookie Monster. Oh, I guess. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think I was telling you earlier, was I? Oh yeah. By the way, fifty. I'll be by. I'll be by. I'm gonna give you some my crazy merch. Don't worry. We'll replace that Gucci. Thanks. Okay. But but like, <laughs> hopefully you get them the right size, though, Matt. That is that, that is, that is a, a, a Why do you troll him like that? What do you think? What do you, what do you think? Fifty <laughs> sizes. Why do you troll him like that? <laughs> I know you, I know you love fifty that much, Matt. <laughs> you probably do know a shirt this size. Is we're not gonna talk about. That. <laughs> Did y'all talk about that blackface shit? Is I, that what we're talking about? Oh yeah, no, we haven't talked about that yet, but we will. Oh, okay. The uh, the uh, what's it called? I think he's extra large just because of the biceps. Five festival. No. Wow, that was a, he's well, definitely I mean, double. Double. Yeah. I, I'm not surprised that guy's trying to do that again, bro. My dad don't even wear double XL either. Like my dad's like three X, but it's because of his gut. Did you see Ja Rule's Twitter? Yeah. After that shit? What? What'd he it say? It was funny. What'd he say? I don't know. A lot of shit. He I, was like, I, he was like, Five Festival was not my fault, bro. I know. Oh, yeah. And then, um, I don't even know what he said. He just said a bunch of bullshit. Like, it was not my fault and shit. Like, you can't, do, yeah, do we you, care what Ja Rule's Twitter went like crazy this? on him. They were like, Not really. But it is your fault. I'm not gonna lie, though. Shit happens. Like, with, but his concept, the, the app, the actual, what they were trying to do, was a pretty dope concept, though. All right, TJ MV, calm down. What do you mean? I'm just saying, putting people in contact with celebrities and shit that way. How, what, Making it easier to network with people. Word for rich and people. Find, yeah, I guess. Talent, but it had, to, had, to, had to be. You like know, legitimate. eventually it's gonna spread. Everything yeah, always trickles down eventually. I know, in the right? technology probably, world. And he probably backed down <laughs> on some shit where like he wasn't trying to sign over. You know what I'm saying? Everything like because that's a great idea. Like, what and it would it? benefit what, a lot of people that do? actually have talent. And are Essentially, trying. the whole concept of Fire was originally gonna be an app that put celebrities in contact with typical everyday people who had cash. So they could hire these people out and like do private shows or events and stuff like that and venues and such. Uh, people like us could even hold venues easily <coughs> with the, some of these artists if we got capital together and like mm -hmm. held like small fucking festivals. You know what's the and problem shit. with that? But you know what's the real problem with that? What? A lot. Once of you're a celebrity, you, you don't, don't want to fucking that. do that. Also, a lot of the, a lot of these celebrities sign away their touring and their are uh, and they're yeah they they're, can't they're tour live, because they sign stuff. away their sh their tours to certain places companies. If you do Coachella, you're pretty you pretty much locked in mind, into that. I hear like, you, but you gotta keep in mind this would offer a new outlet to even those new and upcoming other non celebrities who are now becoming celebrities. Those people are already doing that. Yeah, everyone's signing a deal, unfortunately. That's the point, though. It's a no, new no. form of deal. And I'm it would saying, offer new contracts, a I'm new way of looking at the industry. Five mm -hmm. Festival is... It's the new... It would have been the new bro, YouTube, essentially. Listen, mm -hmm. if, you know? If, new platform. Yeah, if what you were saying is what you're talking about, right? That stuff already happens in the UK. Like, my friend Jesse that I went on tour with or whatever for photos. Okay, but is it happening here? <clears throat> That's what they did over there. No. It doesn't. You don't so need. Uh, you don't it. need an app to organize it, and he does do it. He actually no. I'm lying. We did down to North Isn't Carolina. That, they scheduled it. Agents for? They scheduled them. Yeah, that's what the agents for. Also, yeah, a lot of these places. Some have people agencies. do. When you're an upcoming artist, you do house gigs because you're an upcoming artist. Mm -hmm. 
And, and once you reach the level of doing huge venues, you don't want to fucking do that anymore. Also, I'm, who's if that you're market making for? the same cash, why app, you do it? I'm saying that app is useless. Also, a lot of if who's that the market same for? Cash? Other than making those small people um, be able to come up a little bit easier because then they have an app to organize with. Why not? But it's then, also, then the, the target. It's a new stepping stone. Then the people that they targeted or, for it <coughs> are not the people that they wanted because they they it's enticed the same thing it with celebrities. YouTube. No, it's not. You two came onto the show. Everybody fucking dude. My fucking English teacher. He was a technology English teacher. Came up to me and said, "This thing is going to be where people are going to be watching and viewing TV in the future." I looked at him. I was like, "Get the hell out! This this is just funny. This is never going to catch on." Boom! There it is. Everybody hated on this concept. It could still All catch. Right, well, I think. you're comparing YouTube to a thing that failed. Absolutely. <laughs> in concept. You know, in but, theory. And also, here's the issue. I don't think work. it would have been. It hasn't issue. had the opportunity the because issue. the whole festival came in and it fucked everything up. Here's the issue. Mm-hmm. Also, with the fire. Here's also with the, the issue with the fire app. Most of these artists already use Instagram and have their management email on the in the Instagram bio, so you can already get connected with them if you have money. That's how I get connected with a lot of these artists. It's literally exactly, in that's, my, that's exactly my point. You have yeah. an agent to do that already. Why <clears throat> the fuck do you need an app to do that? And they're, well, they, well, they already use Instagram. Instagram. If you think for a second that that fire Instagram, app was going to be free, hey, then if you're my agent, yeah, and we're A-list actors, uh, are you going to give a fuck about Joe Schmo Clay over here who wants to hire you out for his kid? With it? But he's got the same capital. He, he, he's a nobody, though. He's a CEO <laughs> in a huge business corporation. He, he's technically in the business world. He's you. But he's the businessman. So okay. he doesn't know anybody in your area. But hey, he wants to call your agent. Your agent going to give a fuck about him because he's a nobody. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. No, they do. But no. That's what the agency is for. If you say, if you say Unless, until the agency sees what I'm doing, they're not going to give a fuck. Well, no. Off, off rip, they're not going to give a fuck. He's going to hear the name and be like, whatever, who are you? Yeah, like I, I, ain't, I no, didn't hear the name. No, a lot of these agencies are staffed well enough if you say, I... I, I or, yeah, I don't want to do a performance. They'll say, "Here's how much it is," and if you say, "All right," yeah, there's some agencies that'll look into it and, and give you an offer. But, no, most agen- but, most agencies but, go go enough where they they'll at least they'll give you the number. And if you if you don't, it's up to you if you don't match it. Like I've talked to a lot of these agencies. They'll they'll talk to you enough to the point where they'll give you. Be real numbers. with you, honestly. We're past the point of signing deals for like. Other than distribution for most artists. Yeah, but honestly, you still need agency just to get off the ground. You just, you know, you don't got to work no. with the top dog. You just got to work with the, somebody who's going to give you the publicity. There's a lot of artists that go independent. And that's just they... getting out there. That's getting you photo shoots. That's giving you the videographers <clears throat> and photographers yeah, for still certain company, events and shit. You know what I'm saying? There's some like, artists that just don't have it together. I do think they still, I there's think like labels and stuff like that. I think you also need a good marketing more. scheme. It's hard. Well, that's what the festival was supposed to be for. And unfortunately, that it got fucked up horribly. Yeah. Horribly, they went to shit. They made too many promises. They they paid out the ass. Focus. They hammered shit. And, and, and not gave, only that, they gave, gave fi- bread with like cheese. Didn't Fifty sabotage that shit? No, <laughs> uh, I know he sabotaged one of his shows though, and like nobody bought tickets. And yeah, that, was, that was the difference. This these tickets were fifteen grand a piece. Now th- this was okay. a situation where Ja Rule. Well, I alleged, no, I know the situation. Yeah. I'm just I, I thought the no, two. The, the, no, this was a different situation where. Groupon was because Ja doesn't get paid a lot for shows. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. no. so yeah, his, bro. His Civic show, Center had had it was like his shows, fifteen dollars for yeah, a his ticket. tickets are like ten yes. bucks. So if fifty saw it on Groupon because one of his yeah, his, yeah, yeah, and then he was like, "You gotta be kidding me!" So he bought like three hundred tickets. Yeah, I know. I heard it. that. I remember was, that. That was a different situation. Okay, yeah. so like no, yeah, no one showed up to that show. Yeah, apparently. yeah, but no. But the thing is though, that's all. Oh, that's all good said and done. But he still got paid for those fucking tickets though. That was yeah, three thousand dollars. Yeah, that ain't but shit. But still, though, that ain't shit. I know it's not shit. And that's shit. why Fifty did it to shit on him. Yeah, yeah. I get it. I get it. He's <laughs> like, here, let me pay your bills. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yeah. shit yeah. lights on. I, yeah, no, trust yeah. me, I understand that. Yeah. I understand that. I would have taken that slap in the face too, but then the he still got money. Okay. 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 I guess you know. Yeah, listen. If, it yeah, if that's everybody's argument in the world ever, then just fuck you. That's what I have to say. The, to that. You, know, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, <laughs> that's that's my worst fuck you. I, I like Fifty in the, in the Stephen Colbert interview. He's like, "We gotta see how good of a performer he is now. See how good he is without the first four rows there." Yeah. It's kind of it's kind of hard to perform when the first four rows are completely empty. That mm. is a fact. Because people either gonna stay where they at or they gonna move to the front. Yeah. Is it blocking well, it off? Also, just a, a venues, a venues, probably like half empty uh, at that point. Yeah. So it's kind of you know you gotta you gotta really put on a performance for it. R.I.P. Ja Rule's career. 
<laughs> I'll rap he that shit for real. <laughs> yeah. I see what he's trying to do, though. He's trying to get in the tech industry, like, you know. He's trying to play it smart in the business world because musically, it's not, it's not awesome. working. So he's trying to invest his money. Mm. And unfortunately, <laughs> he's investing in the wrong business ventures. It's a shame yeah. he can't find a writer or somebody to put him on a new fo- on a new drip, though. Like, he couldn't find nobody. 50 murdered. Yeah, his career. His That's a career. Fact. That's a fact. It's, it is, like, there's no coming back from that. Yeah. You can't, no. Mm. Yeah. Bye. R.I.P. Ja Rule. Yeah. Sorry. See ya. Anyways, fucking bad baby. Oh god, bad baby's got a Snapchat series, guys. Um, You're the only one who watches it. Is, yeah, yep. I, I watched it. I didn't it. even know it existed. No, I, the only reason I want to bring it Word. up though, because I I want to say this right now. I think Atlantic Records. She signed Atlantic Records. I think Atlantic Records might be one of the smartest labels right now with how they're working with all the different artists from like the <sighs> people with actual talent to like these kind of like meme internet sensations like her. But the same, I want to know who the fuck greenlit this show because it is the worst idea, having her on a Snapchat show. But like, what exactly is she doing on the show? She's just being a brat, and then her mom's, and then her mom in some episodes, in the more later episodes right now, is kind of being a little bit, (coughs) is kind of being like insecure that she likes the security guard, her security guard. Mm -hmm. But honestly, like watching this, she not like no, she actually like. Trust the security guard. She, oh, okay. she doesn't have a dad, so you know it's just like I watched the fucking show. I don't know. I didn't know uh, about this bitch until like five minutes ago. <laughs> uh, yeah, facts. But no, her security guard is the, like honestly, her security guard is the only one that I think actually has like her. Excuse me. Her what's she her, 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 her best her intentions? Her. Yeah, her what best intentions. Because he's like, is he talking about? Right talking about now, bad bro. baby. She got that one song where it's like Gucci flip flops. Yo. I'm a bit bad. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I ain't gonna lie, my girl listen to that. Like, <laughs> you see, all you need is a little, a little cloud, that, and you get put in the, the right thing situations. Too, is that beat is actually a ski mask beat? I did not realize. Yeah. Until I heard the other day, I was listening to one of his songs, and I was like, "What the fuck is this?" And I was like, "Yo, she probably contacted him." No, was no, like, no, Yo, I want to use it. Yeah, so it makes sense. So, yeah. but but no, like the. Ma- I was like, that's why this song is lit. This beat is hard. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I still yeah, can't believe how she fucking did all that shit to fucking uh, Iggy or whatever at that. that uh, what she yeah. do to Iggy? She threw some water on her. Hilarious. Oh. Yeah, but like that's Fuck I'm Iggy like, yo, like you would find it funny. Yeah, why? Why is that not funny? She's bro? she's see. That's it's just like, what do you what do you do? That's, like, that's a child at one of these things, and she's trying bro, to. And that's why Iggy is doing it because she knows she's doing anything bad. Yeah, she is, but it's so like, what's the point of throwing water? This whole show though is like, oh yeah, when she turns eighteen, one of these people are gonna beat her ass. One of these What is the full context of that shit though? Isn't isn't it like something they had like beef or some shit? I know she just said she just said something offhand in an interview, and since she's young, she took it as shade and was just like, you know how it is. Young creators sometimes they just take. Stupid shit of shade. Word. That doesn't even, like, doesn't even matter. Word. Young and people. it's like, I wasn't even thinking about you, bro, but all right. Like, you think, I, all right, whatever. And then, she, but she's 15 and she decided to be wild. And she also has got a security guard that's six foot five, <laughs> 300 pounds. Except now that, now he's like fired. See, when I think about her sometimes, I mean, like, I really just think about that episode of South Park where, where Cartman like dresses up like the fucking... Uh, brat, like oh school girl on the show, is like, <laughs> so, no, she is. Yeah, where yeah, exactly. This is what I'm gonna say about Iggy Azalea and her so career. I don't care. I do what I want. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna say. First of all, that That's girl not- is from an actual episode of Doctor Phil. Yeah. Yeah, that bitch. Yeah. But no, what I'm saying. This chick's is- like what, fifteen? Na- yeah. yeah. I can feel that. I feel like that shit. And is that fake. shit happened two years ago. <laughs> that shit That's is crazy. fake. I don't know why we all fed into that, but that shit cannot be real. There's no way she was on Dr. Phil and it was yeah, real. She, no. And then now she's, she's got really a rap like career that. and that she, shit was real. She's really like that. Though, well, no, like, she was a meme. I'm sure <clears throat> she's a bitch, but they definitely played it up for Dr. Phil's cameras and then she became a meme and then like it became a rap career. But that's yeah. She acts like that because it's what makes her money. No, no, I get that, but right now, her name it's should not be a good look. Me. It doesn't also, even look good. She's a female snitch dumb. nine. She just looks hey. dumb. Yes, she is. Also, you know what? Two is, I feel like... Fuck Iggy Azalea because she still just is like a fake ass rapper and the yeah. most relevant thing about her career she good, is that she, trash. she is dating Playboy Cardi right now and that's the most relevant thing about her right now. I gotta pee. Oh, 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 and some dancer had a seizure on the stage with her performing. Oh, no. Nah, which I get it, like, cool. you know, like, the, you gotta keep performing, right? But she was just rapping over and the lady, like, seizure out and it's just weird. That's weird. Oh, well, sometimes, I, I, so I mean, sometimes the music's loud, you don't know. No, she, she, she looked back and said, call help. 
and become graphic. <laughs> like, Jesus it's Christ. It's a really bad look. I don't know, though. Like, I guess I wouldn't stop the show, but I don't know. As a performer, I probably would just because... I mean, you know, you don't know the story I, I behind it. Girl, you know, when you're in that no, Hollywood no, no. scene, Watch people the video. Like, things like Obviously, that, right? like, people are really like, you know, if you're in show business, you would know that you just keep performing. Which I totally understand, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I'm going to be real with you. If I'm a fucking getting paid, like, however much she's getting paid, probably a lot for a show, right? And my dancer, background dancer, has a seizure on stage. I'm cutting my song off! Rappers do it all the time. Cut their songs off for bullshit. i seen a yeah, video of Biggie yeah. throwing oh, yeah. his water bottle at the DJ. Oh, the DJ word. That the was hilarious. Day, right? So what are we talking about here oh, yeah, no, with, the, like, oh, the, the show goes on, like... The no, DJ no, no. Kept, I'm like, just saying if she didn't see her, I, the, 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 if she no, didn't no, see no, her, she turns around and goes, call and help, up the and then goes right back to rap. No, yeah, I would, I would like, she, she, she was through with, like, call help as an ad lib, I'm pretty sure, like, <laughs> yeah, in her rap. Take. Like, it was really wild. No, I would have I stopped, stopped the song. I, I would have been it. like, yo. I get it. The show goes on. I get it. But that is not a song. Another bad look. No, like, shout out to the game. I know I talked a little bit. I talked shit about the game last week, but... Someone passed out in like the third row of his show once, and he literally just stopped. It, stopped. He's like, "Yo, stop everything. Make sure he's okay." And then he was like, "We just gotta get you some pussy," but which wasn't, you know, obviously probably the best solution to that. But you know, um, Ivy bag and some poontang. Ah, uh, shit, I'm down. He's just like, "You're, what are you a little thirsty? Don't worry, we're gonna get you some pussy later." As soon as he saw he was okay, I'm just like, "But no, real G shit. He did stop the show." If I hit this again, will it lock it up? N- uh, maybe. Yo. How hard is it to unlock? It, it'll go for at least five minutes at first, then <laughs> ten minutes, then twenty-four hours. Wow. Yo, savage. Savage, savage. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Savage, savage. Josh, you literally can't get into the phone. Like, it won't let you back in. <laughs> <laughs> for like twenty-four hours, all right? Yeah, but what if he needs his phone for 24 hours? You'll still be able to make 911 calls if he needs. <coughs> no, but what if someone calls him? He won't be able to see calls. He won't be able to receive calls. He won't be able to receive go to messages, anything. What if he's got Snapchat? <laughs> what if he got Snapchat streaks? They're gone. <laughs> oh, my God. Hold on, you still doing it? Yeah. Oh, You're wild. You play too much. Oh, shit. I got his bank card here. Slide that, slide it back. Slide no, you're back. wild. Go, go, go. You're so wild, everyone. <laughs> yo, chill out. <laughs> yeah. Yo, yo. Did you lock it? No, I didn't. Did you lock it? No, fuck, stop. You, you're, st- no, no. Guys, this is why you can't go to the bathroom on a podcast. Hey, he fucked my phone. This is he the way he fucking. He didn't fuck your phone. He's well, a, I said fuck my phone. iPhone's disabled, try again. coming right now. Damn. I'm not going to get it in time. So dumb. <laughs> anyway, hey, uh, we don't have any next topics. I don't oh. think right now. Uh, what what we do? But let's see Black what we face. got. I think. Oh yeah, we do the Gucci Black. We didn't really get into that with Fifty Cent and all that shit. Whoa, and Fifty Cent boycotting. I got my own mic. Get your own fucking mic. Ti is boycotting. Yeah. Uh, Everyone's be boycotting for three months. I'm boycotting. I except, think except the, for Floyd Mayweather. I He's think the his only Gucci. time the show must go on is a Broadway play. Right. Gucci's blackface was fucking crazy. That bro. was wild. Um, I saw one comment that was just like, wow, people are way too oversensitive about a ski mask. I'm like, no, that's not a ski mask. That's not a fucking that's ski, not a ski mask. mask. This is, what I'm wearing right now, this is a ski mask. That you should not mask. give it attention, though. Like, this is not. When they say the ski mask way, you I, put think, this I on. think covering it, Shout honestly, is counterintuitive because it's giving them the publicity that they wanted. Yeah, but it's not good publicity. You see people shopping at H and M like they used to. I, I want to talk about fifty. No, I want to you talk get everything for ten dollars at H and M. But now you get everything. H and M is now the new era pastel, bro. You get everything for five and ten dollars at H and M, bro. It's true. Word. They always got a sale. That's mm. why I buy like. So it's gonna be the same thing there. with Gucci. Gucci gonna be like, not to cut on Ralph Lauren, but it's gonna be like on the same level as like affordable Ralph Lauren type shit. Like that shit gonna drop to like at most three hundred dollars. I feel like. Damn, fuck All they loafers gonna drop to like one something instead of being like two or three. Cause I was gonna buy some loafers. Not now. Y'all can suck my dick. <laughs> anyway. But yeah, son. That shit was brazy. That was, that was wild. That was wild. And what, what hurts the most is the fact that I haven't heard them apologize about it yet. I, they put out an apology. I ain't see it. Have you heard, have you heard about an apology? I don't know, but I didn't. Have actually, you heard about an apology? Actually, I didn't actually look for the apology. 
I mean, I, mean, like, I feel like yeah. if they apologized, we would have heard by now. T.I. would have been, like, no, everybody totally, would have been talking uh, about it. I'm pretty sure they totally put out a public apology. I think it was just bullshit, though, you know what I mean? I don't think so. I ain't hear I, I think it was. A, I think it was like the PR apology when they put it. When they like finally took it down, they're like, "Hey, we found something. We have something that we didn't like agree with, or that we were." Yeah, uh, after we, you done posted it, after or no something we did, we were tone deaf on or something <laughs> like that. I do remember that, but they didn't like. They didn't do apology to Tone Ti or anyone else. Like good, good terminology. Gucci good political launches answer. action plan to increase diversity after blackface sweater apology. I mean, they need more. They need more diversity if they can't see to that. Yeah, definition. so they definitely did apologize. So you're, you're bugging if you think they didn't, but like well, that doesn't that's what make I'm saying. it. I, I didn't look for the apology. That doesn't so. make it better. But I'm not gonna it lie, doesn't. man. There was a time when um, I want to say either Hollister or Air Postel, one of those. I remember my friends were working there, and somebody changed the online listing because they worked there, and I remember they seen it. Somebody changed the online listing for a, a pair of brown shorts to N-word brown shorts. Wow. That's what they labeled them on the website. Yeah. That's crazy. Bro. Oh, yeah, I heard about crazy, that. That's bro. Crazy, bro. And people still fucking wear that okay. to this oh, day. Shit. Yeah, you could uh, argue that maybe it's gotten cheaper, but, I mean, I don't really feel like that makes a difference. Nah, that don't make a difference at all. Like, I mean, people are going to You could name it something Gucci. else. People you are could put Gucci. a different picture. Give it, give it five, ten years. People wear Gucci in. Yeah, because even no, my, it's just even gonna my be sister, like, but that's just gonna fall off for another like twenty years. It's gonna fall off <laughs> for a minute. I, I mean, I think it's extremely fucked up. I've never bought Gucci. I was never planning to buy Gucci because you got to think I'm about it. If, if if Soldier Boy, who been wearing that Gucci headband for the longest, said he not Ooh, wearing Gucci no more, like shout out Big Draco. If oh, he said he's taking off the Gucci headband. Yeah, bro. <laughs> even <laughs> he even he took off the Gucci, that's bro. Lit. That's lit. So I'm like, yo, if he took off that see, Gucci headband, he's gonna have no designer clothes. I wanna see him burn it though. He's gonna have no designer clothes. Like like 50. I'm gonna Get see him burn it, bro. Yeah. Yo, shout out to 50. Like those Nike shirt. shoes that all the white people were doing. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna see. Him. And fuck Floyd Mayweather for being a dickhead. <clears throat> Yo, I wonder if Gucci, like, is cheaper. I'm about to check. Oh, man, my phone died, but I wanna check, like, Grailed. Mm. Or, like, a reselling app to see if Gucci's, like, prices are dropping. It probably is dead ass, though. Probably, but I'm not wearing that shit. Like, it could be $2. It's not the first company that's done this, though, man. Yeah, but well, this, this the more I this find out, hurt. the more I'm gonna stop wearing them designer shits because I already just be wearing what I wear. Like I wear Nike. I forget who just did that. I wear that. I nice shit. I wear like my Tims, my my kicks. I don't even wear Jays no more, bro. I can't. The last pair of Jays that I bought was probably my fucking Olympics, and I regret that shit because it's not the same material at all, and that's what threw me off. You know, what DC's else? on sale. Facts. <laughs> my crazy merch. Vans. Yep. My crazy merch is some good stuff. I'm just yeah. saying. These are the most expensive things I'll buy. And I've had these for about two years, and I'm going to keep rocking them until I feel like it's Them necessary. Tims. Yeah. Got to rock the Tims. Tims Timbo last se- you forever. Timbo season facts. So, dude, can we talk about... Uh, I didn't actually watch the Grammys, because... Sure, sure. We can tell everyone for going. Fuck the Grammys. <laughs> uh, well, not really yeah. fuck the Grammys, but I, kept, but I don't really care. Yeah, we're way late on the Grammys, shout, anyway. Shout out to Cardi B for being the first woman to win uh, <laughs> rap, album of the year. Rap, rap album of the year, man. Shout out to her. And shout out to Childish Gambino for... Um, having the first hip hop song win uh, song of the year that was dope I didn't even know that until I read that too that's, yeah that's dope as shit it's crazy but, um, that it what, took what, what, what type of backlash did Cardi B um, receive I know I know, she, and that made her delete her Instagram cause I, I heard about it but I didn't people really... are haters that's one thing I've, I've learned wait she deleted it yeah, yeah she, well she deactivated it I'm, I'm not sure I'm pretty sure she people didn't delete it people hate you what, what, one thing I've learned is especially as I wait just why like, are people mad at Cardi B what she do uh, you, you, people gotta for, people forget that she she's new to this fame thing. Matt, it's like if one of us just got famous right, right now. But like I want to know the answer to my people, question. I, well, I'm answering your question. You just don't want to actually listen. So imagine. So like think about it. If it, it's just like people will just hate on social media. Like, so basically, it, she was just getting a, a lot of negative comments like yeah. in her feeds and, and shit. She, and it's not like she's been famous for a while, so it's just affected her. Mm. She's not used to it yet. She hasn't built a thick skin. Yeah, yeah. She, she's also got to realize that Nicki Minaj has a lot of fans. Yeah. So yes. the fact that <laughs> she accomplished something over Nicki and then you got the few people that might be, you know, hyping her up saying, yo, you better than Nicki, da-da-da. You're going to see well, the thing. people come out of nowhere people defending Nicki Minaj. Nicki Minaj. That combined with the fact that she's also coming after Tommy Loren. People people hate more than they she's show got love. got all those white people going yeah, crazy. Yeah, all those white people going crazy. It's easier crazy. to hate than show love. Yep, it's sad, but it is. And people, all those fly people going but, crazy. One thing that I found interesting, and I actually got it. I want shout out to Twenty One. You got free. Yeah. For, oh, yeah, Twenty One Savage. Twenty One Savage is free. <laughs> I've seen that. Uh, There's an interview too. I gotta watch yeah, it. Yeah, the interview is crazy. He said he got set up. I believe it. One thing I want to talk about was Nicki Basically. Minaj canceling her BET show. 
And uh, I actually agree with Nikki on this one. Surprise, surprise. Holy shit. Yeah, for, for fucking... Uh, so, Cardi won the rap album of the year. BET uh, tweeted it and then added their own little <coughs> snarky caption. Uh, meanwhile, Nikki's getting dragged by Lace Fronts. And they had a show. They were supposed to do oh, a live show. Shit. A Young Money live show, yeah. And then Nikki responds like, all right, well, that's canceled. And... Honestly, yeah, she really snap. I believe she should. That was smart. Yeah, I'll say, uh, I, I don't. I don't blame her. Yeah, I don't blame her. Because like, if you're gonna do it, like that's I do the same thing. If I'm gonna do a show for you, it's not like she. They just said she won the award. It's that little extra snarky thing. Don't make yeah, don't yeah. make a snarky comment. But at the same time, no, you can't they're just blame, trying to reach for clout to get you some can't blame BT bro. Exactly. themselves. You gotta blame whoever was in charge of that Twitter. Account. Oh yeah, no, that Twitter. Account oh, they're fired. fired. Yeah, no, yeah, they're fired. They got Nikki, fired. Nikki put up. I think Nikki put up the photo of the girl also that runs that Twitter, which is a little, which is a little too far. Damn. Yeah. It was a little too far. That's the one thing I yeah, don't agree with. Yeah, that's kind of fucked up. Because <laughs> you technically could be putting that person's life in jeopardy. Yeah, yeah knowing, like now she could knowing, sue Nikki. Also knowing Nikki fans, yeah. Yeah. That that's what I'm saying. She could sue People Nikki. People are crazy yeah. enough, they'll go out and like cut a bitch, unfortunately. Yeah, because Nikki fans really go crazy. Like, I know this one girl from my college, and I, every time <laughs> I see her on Instagram, she's always bumping Nicki Minaj. She be talking mad shit to Cardi B. Like, yeah. she know them and shit. Posted Nikki, like, Nikki be hanging with her every day, bro. Like, these fans girls are crazy. Fans crazy, man. These girls are crazy. Yeah. Dudes too. But you know, yeah. Dudes too. Stan. <laughs> Fact. But you know, I actually agree with Nikki on something, so you know, I just thought I should say that. Yeah, word. Hi, Nikki. I'm a, I see you. Just all, that's all I'm gonna say. That was really creepy. No creep shit. No creep shit. Until, until I have the uh, the conspiracy just evidence. Stop. The just evi- stop. The evidence just for the conspiracy. Just stop. Don't worry. Man said, we have the conspiracy. Hi, Nikki. Hey, Nikki. Just stop. What's up, Nikki? How you doing? I'm weak. Stop well, so carrying that around. How, how long until Offset's going to beat my ass? <laughs> uh, why you say that? <laughs> Have you seen how close he is? Like Now he's really trying hard to get back with Cardi. And after everything I said, once they broke up, or I thought they broke up, yeah. Like, <laughs> offset is gonna uh, that, not for nothing. Son, you're like I, he said, I'm gonna offset that pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak. So bets. If That's I ever uh, meet Offset, it's uh, that. It's never. Yeah. It's never. Sure, uh, sure you're it's fine, dude. Yeah, you can chill anywhere, but just don't Chill, say bro. just don't say nothing crazy when you see him. Just, you know what, what are you talking about, bro? What are you even talking about? What? What? Just stop. Just stop. What are you worried about? Just stop. I don't know. I'm dead. Just, just stop. stop. <laughs> Why is an Offset gonna fight you? You good? <laughs> all right. Because if you fight an Offset, then you're fighting all the Migos. Oh no, I could take all the Migos. They would like transform <laughs> together into. Yeah, I feel like I feel like I'm better than Quavo at basketball. I can take all. I can take all Transformers. The Quavo not that nice. That motherfucker <clears throat> played a long ass game. The whole game, damn near, only. Do you had think 20 those points. sunglasses are just for I style? I score thirty. He shoots laser beams out of his eyes, bro. Yo, listen. When they be playing them basketball celebrity basketball games, yo, they be trash. They let Justin Bieber run circles around these motherfuckers, bro. Like, I mean, they're celebrities. They're not basketball players. Yeah, I know, but like. Still, if I was ever play in one of them games, man, like how Quavo be getting these, Quavo got a deal with like fucking with like Nike or Adidas or some shit like that or Finish Line something. They got a, a deal because he got uh, the the celebrity like you know MVP or whatever for the game. He only had like 18, 19, 20 points, some shit like that. I don't think he had twenty. I think he had like eighteen, nineteen. Bruh, Trash. let me get famous and get in one of them games. It's over. I get my Nike deal <laughs> off some rap shit. But. Yeah, what was good? We, we we went through everything. We burned through everything. Uh, I mean, besides Russell Wilson, uh, being husband of the year for buying Sears Masters back allegedly. I don't even know who that. That's is. pretty dope. Though. That's dope. Football player. And Football I know player, that. And I know that was Sierra. a lot. Hell yeah! Cause know. you know the record company ain't gonna give that shit a free. Mm-hmm. No, they just gave. They usually just give out a wild number, not expecting you to actually pay it. Yeah. And, <laughs> and, and, then, like, and then he's hey. just like, all right. He's probably like, I got about a mil less than that in cash. Mm-hmm. Give me that. What did he do? He bought her. He bought her masters. He bought her yeah. masters. So now Sierra owns all her songs. Like Straight all the up. hits she got from the beginning when we was jits. They all essentially hers she's one hundred percent indie. Fuck, she's free. Yeah, <coughs> she contract. Don't, she don't no, owe nothing. nobody nothing. That's crazy. she managed her own self. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. she can leverage that into a new deal. Yeah, as absolutely. Well. Facts. That's crazy. She can also her own company. That's big dick energy right there. <laughs> yeah, that, that is, is some that's big awesome, dick man. energy yeah. Yeah. right there. Not even Future owns his masters. Word. Word. She's became very full lady. Mm-hmm. She can do a lot. That's a fact. Wow. But, okay. But yeah, real quick, I'm I just want to say never a quick to a label, RIP to the Mars rover. Real fast. Yeah, he died. <laughs> he died. He did. It's dead. My man uh, said, 
R.I.P. Yeah, but there's a new one up there. You said what's the name of it? Um, Mars the, Rover the, Two. The, the new Rover. Mars Rover Two. Oh, um, curious. Curious. George. I, no, I will curiosity. say courage. Curiosity. Yes, you're correct. My fault. Curious curiosity. George. It's curious George. He's got, a, he's got a yellow hat. Yeah, that's cool though. I'm glad they got another one up there. Found some. Uh, That'd be acidic. awesome if we actually started colonies on Mars. <laughs> yeah, if Imagine we did. Shit. You know what Just we would call? You know what we mean. would call you? <laughs> what we would call you? What? Dino no. The that. Martian. Yeah, everybody's name changes on Mars because of the gravity. Facts. Adds more letters. <laughs> believe it or not. That shit would be crazy if, if we had to move to a whole new planet though. I mean, it's bound to happen eventually. We're going to blow this one up pretty much. I'm choosing Venus. It's a little warm. Eventually going to fry. We're going to get cooked. It's a little <laughs> warm we're going on at. Venus. You know what I'm saying? I fucked up. I'm trying to be at the beach all day. Fuck that, man. Yeah. Can't I'll wait till New York I'll be dead before it happens. beaches. Word. So it ain't my problem. Yo, are you excited for New York to have lit beaches? Uh, I mean... I guess. You have to have what? Oh yeah, because awesome we was talking about the 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 the, going, the, the raising oh, temperature. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Word. And... It'll be a time to be alive. But... Say goodbye, New York City. Yeah, <laughs> New York City gone. What the fuck are you doing, Yo, man? man? You're up in my like box, bro. Thanks about Plus. that time, Maddie. Uh, I guess so. And anyways, guys, <laughs> this has been my crazy podcast, episode fifty four. I am me. Matt. No, it's not. Who are y'all? <laughs> Montesi, Mont Pain. Montesi, Mont Pain. <laughs> What are you? He don't matter. I'm Dusty B. <laughs> now and I'm Clay Bones, the MC. And wow, I'm you guys skip me again. Really? You never want to talk, dog. You just sit on there. And I'm not for redundancy's sake. That is it. We'll see y'all next time. We out. <laughs>